I stare at the printout of my schedule that appeared on my bed after breakfast this morning. For something like the tenth time, I read it. I can't help but hope that the words have magically changed since read number nine. They have not. I close my eyes and take several slow, deliberate breaths. That's what Sandra tells me to do when I get anxious. It sort of works. My heartbeat slows down ever so slightly. But I still have a ginormous problem, and I know I won't be okay until everything is fixed. Chewing on the inside of my lip, I search for Audrey. She's at the other end of the cabin, talking with a brown-haired girl whose name I don't remember. Audrey gives the girl a wide smile. Clearly, she doesn't know she just ruined my summer and quite possibly my entire life. My hands jitter in my pockets as I approach her. She's still talking to the other girl. If I were in a movie, Audrey would just know that I have something terribly important to tell her. She would shoo other girl away, nicely of course, and ask me what I need. But in real life, other girl talks for forever. Hey, Maddie, Audrey says once other girl has finally skipped off. What's going on? There's been a mistake. I wave my schedule in the air. Right. Audrey smacks herself in the forehead, reminding me of a hammy actor in a bad sitcom. I wanted to talk with you about this last night. I tried to find you at the campfire, but I couldn't, and by the time I got back to the cabin, you were asleep. The truth is, I had not been sleeping. After my encounter with Chloe, I curled myself in my sleeping bag so I could avoid talking to anyone else but better for Audrey to think I'm an early sleeper than just plain pathetic. After taking in a large gulp of air, I try to straighten out my panicky thoughts. There's only one screenwriting class on my schedule, I say in a wavering voice. That's, that's just a mistake. You printed out the wrong schedule or something, right? Audrey flashes a smile tinged with pity. No, no, and no. I want to run out of this scene. I am really sorry to be the bearer of bad news, Maddie, but our screenwriting instructor had to cancel at the last minute. She got called to fill in as a writer on a new TV show. It's about flight attendants who are actually super spies or something. I'm a little vague on the details. Anyway, a new streaming service wants it, so she had to go. 